find the Fourier series of f of x is equal to x into e to the power minus of mod x. Okay. Now solution. We have f of f of x is equal to f of u that means integration of minus infinity to f of uh, minus infinity to plus infinity f of x into e to the power r u x with respect to x now f of u is equal to okay well, first uh, we make a f of x so f of u is equal to minus infinity to 0 f of x into e raise to i u x with respect to x plus integration of 0 to infinity f of x into e raise to i u x with respect to x so how we get minus infinity to 0 and 0 to infinity ok now f of x is a x into e to the power minus mod x like this ok now one is x into e raised to x for x less than 0 x into e raised to minus x for x is greater than 0 now see x into e raised to minus mod x is now the limit minus infinity to plus infinity is 0 mod means plus or minus this part is a negative means x into e to the power minus and e to the power minus x so minus minus plus x into e raised to x means less than 0 ok then second one x into is a positive e to the power minus of plus x means minus x is a 0 to infinity now f of u is equal to integration of minus infinity to 0 f of x 0 to infinity means x into e raised to x into e to the power r u x with respect to x plus integration of 0 to infinity f of x is a x into e raised to minus x into e raised to r u x with respect to x this is a negative side and this is a positive side now f of u is equal to integration of minus infinity to 0 x into base is same so I'll take 1 plus r u x is a common with respect to x plus integration of 0 to infinity x into same base is a common so minus outside 1 minus i u x is common with respect to x now you apply the integration both the terms uh, apply integration means applying Bernoulli's rule ok so f of u is equal to applying Bernoulli's rule x as it is integration this part is e raised to i u x by sorry uh, 1 plus e raised to 1 plus i u into x upon constant 1 plus i u minus difference at x become 1 and again e raised to 1 plus i u into x divided by one more constant is a 1 plus i u whole square next is not possible close it plus next x as it is integrate this one e raised to minus of 1 minus r u into x divided by minus of 1 minus r u minus sign differentiate x become 1 again integrate e raised to minus of 1 minus r u x divided by minus minus plus so 1 minus r u whole square close it close the bracket and this is equal to uh, first term is what uh, minus infinity to 0 and second one is a 0 to infinity ok now put x is equal to 0 
zero uh, i will take uh, one upon i will take constant outside uh, okay first apply it x is equal to zero zero into this one is zero okay zero minus foot x is equal to infinity infinity is to infinity zero zero into zero first one is zero minus second term uh, one upon this one i'll take outside one plus i u whole square is outside inside is put x is equal to zero e raised to zero e raised to zero is one minus e raised to infinity is a zero next is a um, plus okay put e raised to infinity infinity anything is zero minus put x is equal to zero zero into this one is zero okay minus sign 1 upon 1 minus 1 minus i u whole square this is constant now put x is equal to infinity is a 0 minus put x is equal to 0 means e raised to 0 is 1 0 minus 1 and this is equal to uh, minus into minus plus i will write first positive term minus into minus is a plus 1 upon 1 minus i u whole square and minus 1 upon 1 plus i u whole square and take LCM as a 1 minus IU whole uh, sorry cross multiplication 1 plus IU whole square minus 1 minus IU whole square divided by is 1 plus U square whole square and f of U is equal to a plus b whole square and a minus b whole square a square plus b square plus 2ab a square plus b square minus 2ab and minus outside a square plus minus a square plus b square minus b square cancel minus minus plus 2ab and plus 2ab 4 times ab same this is using 4 times iu divided by is a 1 plus u square whole square now see this one Again same, 1 minus i u whole square, I means uh, it is a 1 plus i whole square, you get 1 plus u square and whole square. This, this is a f of u. This is the required answer. Find the complex Fourier transform of e raised to minus a square into x square. a is greater than 0. Hence, deduce that e raised to minus x square by 2 is self reciprocal in respect of the complex Fourier transform ok now solution f of u is equal to f of f of x is equal to integration of minus infinity to plus infinity f of x into e raised to i u x with respect to x and f of u is equal to integration of minus infinity to plus infinity f of this part is f of x e to the power minus a square into x square into e raised to i u x with respect to x or uh, this integration is minus infinity to plus infinity e raised to minus base is same e raised to uh, minus a square x square plus i u x with respect to x and this is equal to e to the power minus infinity to plus infinity hence deduce that e to the power minus x square by 2 is a self reciprocal in respect of the complex Fourier transform ok now e to the power so I'll take minus a square outside minus a, both the term in degree both the term take minus a square outside inside is x square minus i u x by a a square into with respect to x and this is equal to integration of minus infinity to plus infinity e raised to minus a square into x square now this term you rearrange it degree you rearrange it x square minus 2 x into i u by 2 a square plus i square u square 
by 4 a raised to 4 minus i square u square by 4 a raised to 4 into dx. Now see, 2 to cancel plus minus get cancel, 2 to cancel remaining x square minus i u x by a square. Now adding and subtracting, multiplying and dividing. Adding this one and subtracting again and multiply by 2 and divided by 2. Now next step is we arrange the terms. Next step is integration of minus infinity to plus infinity e to the power minus a square into these terms. First, second, third. This term is a minus b whole square. a square plus b square minus 2ab. It's like this x minus ru I u by 2a square whole square a minus b whole square a square plus b square minus 2ab into this term is e to the power minus u square by 4a square so i square is equal to minus 1 ok i square is equal to minus 1 so i square i square is a plus and again minus a square is there so e to the power minus u square by a square 1 a square for a square this is a raised to 4 and this is a square a square a square cancel a square remaining so minus u square by 4 a square into with respect to x put now put x into Oh, sorry uh, a into x minus iu by 2a square is equal to you take t now differentiate this one this is a this is constant 0 a dx is equal to dt or dx is equal to dt by a with respect to x is equal to now put upper limit and lower, lower limit x is equal to t also varies put x is equal to lower limit you get minus t put x is equal to upper limit you get plus t t varies also from varies minus infinity to plus infinity now using this result in this equation f of u is equal to only right hand side integration of minus infinity to plus infinity e raised to a into x minus i u by 2, 2 a square is equal to t and this is a whole square is there means e raised to t square minus minus sign this is minus is there e to the power minus t square and dx dx means what dt by a this integration with respect to t and this part is a constant take outside e to the power minus u square by 4a square so we know that integration of minus infinity to plus infinity e raised to minus t square dt is a root pi and f of u is equal to and this part is root pi by this a into this part e raised to minus u square by 4a square now taking a is equal to half now f of u is equal to a is equal to half means is a f of u is equal to f of u is e raised to minus x square by 2 that means root pi a means half a means sorry i'll take a square is a half a square is a half a is equal to what 1 by root 2 into e raised to minus u square by a square is equal to 1 by 2 4 by 2 means 2 only divided by 2 and this is equal to final we get square root 2 pi into e raised to minus u square by 2 that means the Fourier transform
e raised to minus x square by 2 Fourier transform of e raised to minus x square by 2 is a constant times means e raised to minus u square by 2 okay the function the function e raised to minus x square by 2 and e raised to minus u square by 2 are same only change the variable that means conclude that e raised to minus x square by 2 is a self reciprocal under complex Fourier transform. So this is a required answer.